Autoimmune disease nowadays become the research focus because there were increasing number of that every year. One of them is systemic lupus erythematosus, or we call it SLE. SLE is a chronic autoimmune inflammatory disease characterized by autoantibodies production and immune complex deposition in various tissue, leading to chronic inflammation tissue. SLE cases increase 3.7 cases per 100,000 population per year. The spike in SLE cases also followed with high mortality rate, which up to 67%. In Indonesia, there were 2,166 SLE cases reported, which 550 were reported deaths. This condition caused by imbalanced immune system to increase production of the helper 1 cell, which plays an active role of cytokine secretion including interferon gamma and interleukin 1, increased production of the helper 17 cell caused by interleukin 17, which led to inflammation induction, and decreased production of the regulator cell which controlled imbalanced immunity also exacerbate SLE conditions. SLA patients with various diverse manifestations require long life treatment with high risk of death, even though various therapeutic methods have been used such as standard drugs including corticosteroid and immunosuppressant. However, the long-term side effects of these drugs can lead impaired nerve function also organ failure. So, it is necessary to develop an innovative drug compounds that targeted to regulate inflammation and reduce side effects. On the other hand, orange pill is a waste byproduct and has not been widely used. In fact, orange pill is suspected to contain compounds which have potential to anti-cancer, antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, and immunosuppressant activities. Until today, the effect of orange pill extract in modulating the response of TH1, D17, and DREX cells, which are rational alternative targets for SLE treatment, still unclear. Therefore, to answer this problem, we took initiative to conduct a research. Potential, Potential exploration of orange pill extract as an immunosuppressant through DH1, D17, and direct regulation on Google to the very blood monoclonal cell model in systemic lupus erythematosus. My name is Sesem Sodik Alaydrus. And my name is Atia Salvi Sriparwoto. We are from SMA Negeri 3 Semarang. On this auspicious occasion, we proudly present our research. Our research is a quantitative research experimental laboratory conducted by observing the effect of orange pill extract in three various doses based on the potential dose of previous research. Our methods divided into three parts. The first part was compound extraction and characterization of orange pill based on phytochemical tests. The extraction process done by maceration process using 96% ethanol solvent and evaporation using ordinary evaporator. Continued with the phytochemical test then characterization process using UVV spectrophotometry. Second part was to collect and isolate blood samples for SLE patients. The SLE blood sample isolated by very viral blood mononuclear cell, which was carried out aseptically using the fecal separation method centrifuge 1000 times G for 30 minutes. Then the buffycot collection by centrifuge process 2500 RPM for 5 minutes and counted using a hemocytometer. After orange pill extract compound and PBMC cell blood sample were counted, we continue the third part namely transwell cell culture method with three kinds of orange pill extract doses. Transwell cell culture method aims to prevent PBMC's contact with orange pill extract as illustrated below. This process required 72 hours of incubation. After that, the PBMC were collected. Then TH1, TH17, and TRX cell were read using specific antibodies and analyzed by full cytometry. We obtained several data from our research. First is orange pill extraction and characterization data. Based on phytochemical screening tests, various types of secondary metabolite compounds has been identified, shown in the following table. We identified that flavonoid compounds were present in orange pill extract, where it has a role in antioxidant and immunosuppressant activity. As you can see, the linear equation in the graphic shows R value close to 1, indicating a linear calibration curve which proves us there is a relationship between flavonoid concentration with the addition of concentration. The higher concentration will also increase the absorbance. The flavonoid content present in orange pill extract resulted was high, which was 90.2143 ppm. For the PBMC's characterization we observe, the PBMC's patients has a colonized morphology and a novel shape. After being treated with orange pill extract, we can see their morphology were changed, the cells were colonized, their shape become more rounded and clumped. Next is the main result of this research, the effect of orange pill extract on TH1, TH17 and TRX cell population. For the effect of orange pill extract on TH1 cell, it was proven that PBMC control group without any treatment showed a high number of TH1 cells. After being treated, as you can see in the following graph, there was a decreasing trend in each treatment group. Starting from 25 microgram per milliliter orange pill extract which decreased TH1 cell to 11.57, approximately 0.55. 
followed by 50 microgram per milliliter orange peel extract which decreased significantly to 8.63, approximately 0.70. The same result was showed in tier 17 cell population. In the 25 microgram per milliliter orange pill extract group, there was increasing trend of tier 17 cells about 20.67, approximately 1.91. This number is significant compared to the control group. However, in the 50 microgram per milliliter orange pill extract, tier 17 cells decreased significantly to 14.17, approximately 0.50. This result shows that the flavonoid compounds contained in orange peel extract has an immunosuppressant effect by suppressing Th1 and Th17 cells. In the direct cell population, we can see the direct present in PBMC control group were low. In the 25 microgram per milliliter orange peel extract group, the number of direct cell increased insignificantly to 0.25, approximately 0.05, compared with control. However, in the 50 microgram per milliliter orange peel extract, Direct cell increased significantly to 2.07, approximately 0.57. By decreasing number of Th1 and Th2 cells and increasing number of direct cell in the treatment group, we can say that the flavonoid compounds present in orange peel extract are able to have an immunosuppressant effect by suppressing the number of Th1 and Th17 cell, also as an immunosuppressant by increasing direct cells. From our research we've done, it can be concluded that orange peel extract has an effect to decrease Th1 and Th17 expression cells number, and also has an effect to increase direct expression cell number in the SLE PBMC cell culture model, which is characterized by a significant change in 50 microgram per milliliter orange peel extract concentration group. That's all for our presentation. Thank you for your attention. We hope that our research can open new insight about Th1, Th17, and direct cell expression that will bring benefits and solutions for autoimmune diseases treatment, especially SLE, by optimizing orange peel leaves, which has promising potential. Opsi 2022, Menarik di Dosero!